Okay. We're here today. Well, <clears throat> this morning. I know it probably looks nighttime to some of you. And yes, it's uh, 5.30 in the morning. And today we're going to talk about what to use on tech. And I'm going to show you today. I made a video about this. This is revisited. Uh, for some of you who actually wanted to see this product in action. And today we're going to attempt to show you. Uh, I know you won't be able to feel the difference in this product over tech versus anything else you're using. So uh, let me get in here before customers start coming in so I can get in and get out of here. Okay, so now we have some light on the circuit. Now, this is the soap for some of you who didn't understand what I meant earlier about this uh, product for the tent. This soap is very gentle, and considering the method that I was using, which was alcohol, <laughs> which was alcohol, uh, this was recommended by the actual people who installed the tent. And as you well know, alcohol does help to uh, get stickers off and, and glue and things of that nature because it has alcohol in it. Like wood alcohol is great for, uh, you know, things of that nature. But on a certain tent, it can start to lift up from the corners. Uh, I'm going to get some water in my pump spray. Hey. I'm going to get some water in my pump spare because my big one has my my uh, slippery solution in it. So I don't need to dump it out just, just to do this inside. So I, I use this pump sprayer only for jobs where I need to change my chemical up like I am now. Chemical guys. Uh, this soap smells very good. It smells like coconuts. And the... Uh, the slippery concoction that's in this bottle is great for window cleaning, but it becomes a little. I have I, I bought a case of these, so I could see I could use it in place of the other green liquid, but I just choose to keep it for the tent. There's nothing wrong with using this on a daily basis because I have. Uh, it just tends to be a little bit expensive compared to. You know, the other soap that we normally would use, like Dawn or uh, Joy or Palm Olive. But I'm not going to read uh, all the oxygen and rich bubble and all that stuff. But it is pH balanced, like a woman. So let's get to work. As you can see, what I was telling you about is starting to come up. Now, it could be a couple of different things. Whoever installed the tent did a poor job, or it could have been the quality of the tent, and it also could have been that when we squeegee, we always squeegee to, to the corner, so that alcohol gets trapped in that corner if they installed the windows I mean the tent poorly uh, what happens is that alcohol that gets caught in that crevice when we're wiping up it ever so st start ever so slightly starts to lift up from the corner I'm not saying that I caused this but I may or may have but it doesn't matter because I was told to use alcohol on it but anyway that alcohol will start to lift up that corner ever so slightly 
And as we continue to clean it, little by little moisture from the alcohol dissolves the glue that's uh, pressed on this glass and it starts to travel upward. And it's on a good number of uh, 10 on that whole row down there. But let's get to work. and things like that. Uh, if you guys have ever cleaned tent, I know some of the vets have cleaned over tent before and it's very grippy. You're limited as to what you can use. But I gotta tell you, this is your one-stop shopping. This is all you're gonna need to clean tent. And the, the glide over tent is unbelievable. And I'm not over exaggerating. It's outstanding. Marvelous, darling. Simply marvelous. Having this slippery concoction is just like cleaning regular glass. But compared to what y'all are used to using, even it's more slippery going over tent than it is to. Uh, squeegeeing over regular glass. This is how slick this formula is. Okay? <clears throat> they use this on high-end cars, Lamborghinis, and Ferraris. And it doesn't mess up their clear coat. So it's safe on tent. Just don't take my word for it. Get a bottle of yourself. And matter of fact, I'm going to do y'all one even better. Under the comments in this video, like, comment, subscribe, whatever it is you want to do, and for those who would like to try this product, like I said, I got a case of this, so I don't care if y'all don't try it or not, I know what it does, so leave a comment below and let me know if you would like to try this product, I will pick one person that I'm going to donate this to, that and the Tory uh, Ettore squeegee off, I'm going to donate these two for the holidays. And this is my gift to y'all as a, a thank you for supporting my, my channel. I don't know what I'm going to do 
as far as picking the right person to try this product out. For those who don't really want to spend money on certain products just to give it a try, here's your chance to get it for free. Uh, if you're used to using uh, washing up liquid, <laughs> y'all crack me up over there in them countries that says washing up liquid. Over here, what that means to me is soap, you know, body wash, washing up liquid because you wash up with it. I don't, I can't understand why y'all call dish soap washing up liquid because y'all don't, wa we don't wash up with dish soap. But, hey, just like uh, people uh, in the country say, uh, well, anyway, I'm not going to go off the subject, but this is all you're ever going to need to clean windows. If, I mean, it's not that expensive. I think this was like 10 bucks, but this is super concentrated and you only need really, uh, it's real thick. Uh, I don't know if y'all can see. Well, the consistency is real thick, and you don't need much to get the uh, bubbles going. If you have a pump sprayer, it comes out like foam. Like if you're washing your car, uh, like a cannon, it comes out like foam. If, if you were to do it like that, it has a high sud con concentration level in here. But this is the only formula that's a soap. That outperforms any other soap that I have ever used in the market as far as the glide is concerned without adding anything else. As far as a glide, this is the, as good as it gets. You don't want anything else in here with this because not only does it dissolve fingerprints and, and grind, the glide, you'll never get a better glide than this. That's all I have to say. Matter of fact, I think I might start replacing, since I got the case now, I had ran out before, which is why I was using the Unger Green stuff with the uh, Pine Saw. Uh, I may not need the Pine Saw with this, but if this smells nice all in itself. But anyway, I got to get back to work, so leave a comment below if you would like to win this Atori Squeegee off and wonder why she would like to try. You don't have to just save it for temp, but you could just use it daily and you're washing up liquid for the windows well washing up liquid i know you guys like to hear that but macrofacalaca peace peace peace